Chris Chinock in the Interlux booth for Insight Media. Uh, here we're going to look at their Active Matrix Micro LED display. Uh, this is a 12.3 inch diagonal uh, tile using 20 by 40 micron uh, LEDs, so um, micro LED size. Uh, as you can see, it's going to be uh, quantum dot converted um, and has this 4,000 to 1 ambient contrast ratio. Uh, so the and here's here's the tile right here. It's, so it's kind of this long aspect ratio here, 12.3 um, inch diagonal. So uh, total uh, luminance for this is 700 nits. Uh, it is a resolution of 480 by 180. Uh, and it works out to about 40 PPI, which is a little low, but not, not, not that bad. It's, you can see a little bit of structure when you're this close to it. Um, so for uh, an automotive display, that would probably be going to be something a little bit higher than that. But they're talking about other applications, as you can see down their chart here, uh, more cinema displays, museum displays, uh, PIDs. So pe people will be a little bit uh, further away, but nonetheless an, an indoor display. Um, I asked them about their fabrication process. Uh, and they basically start with a blue epi wafer. Uh, they then send that to Elux, their, uh, their uh, mass transfer partner, uh, who will transfer that to the LTPS uh, glass backplane uh, and do any repair. So they have a, uh, a final finished uh, tile, that, in blue anyway. Uh, it then goes into an inkjet printed quantum dot process uh, to do the red and green uh, to create the f this full colored display. Uh, on their roadmap is to go to uh, about 200 uh, PPI uh, using the same backplane, which could be appropriate for many more applications. I also asked about this ambient contrast ratio of 4,000 to 1. Uh, this is something that uh, AUO was starting to talk about. It looks like a uh, Interlux is as well. Uh, they do this in about a, uh, they said about a 600 nit environment, so kind of an office level environment. Uh, to get this 4,000-to-1 contrast ratio, which is actually uh, quite good. So it is, it is a very highly reflective surface. There is glass on top of this as well. Uh, so that does help with the contrast in, in, as well. That's Chris Chinock for Insight Media.